Hello friends, welcome back to another comparison video. In this video, we are going to compare the four of the best smartphones that you can buy under the price tag of 7000 rupees. Redmi 3S, Coolpad Mega, Coolpad Note 3 Lite and Swipe Elite Plus. If you want to buy the best smartphone possible, do watch this video till the end. Without any further ado, let's get started. All the four smartphones were selling for the same price tag of 7000 rupees. So before going in deep, let's check the specs of the smartphones. Pause this video if you want to look at the specs of all these four smartphones. I mentioned the specs in such a way that it can be compared with all the other smartphones. Theoretically, on comparing the specs, Swipe Elite Plus could be the best among these four smartphones and the second best could be Redmi 3S, but we are not going to compare just by seeing at the specs. I will be comparing these smartphones after using all these smartphones for at least 30 plus days. So let's start with the design and build quality. Speaking of the design, Redmi 3S scores ahead of other smartphones because of its metal body design and the premiumness of the smartphone also really good. The build quality is excellent. Next let's go to Coolpad Mega. Only the sides are made up of metal and the back is made up of plastic but still the design looks extremely good. Even with the 5.5 inch display, it is very comfortable to hold. These two smartphones are kind of similar even with the same back finishing and all the other aspects. So let's talk about some of the other things. Both 3S as well as Mega doesn't have a removable back cover because of its metal body. The lightest of them all is Might Valid Plus with just 131 grams. The second lightest is Coolpad Mega with 140 grams. And the third lightest is Redmi 3S with 145 grams. And the heaviest of them all is Coolpad Lite. So if you are the person who like lighter smartphones, go with Coolpad Mega or Swipe Elite Plus. Speaking of the display quality, Swipe Elite Plus and Coolpad Mega has a better display quality when compared to other two smartphones. The biggest advantages comes in Redmi 3S as well as Mega was its OLT support. Both these smartphones support OLT and Redmi 3S was the only smartphone which doesn't have any problem in supporting GeoSIM. I used both these smartphones. And the other two smartphone Coolpad Lite as well as Swipe Elite Plus doesn't have OLT support. Both the Coolpad model have 3GB RAM. These two smartphones have extendable memory card as well as dual SIM card support. Whereas these two smartphones on the left hand side Coolpad Mega as well as Redmi 3S doesn't have a extendable memory card slot. Instead they have dual SIM card support with hybrid SIM card slot. Redmi 3S as well as Coolpad Mega is running on Android Marshmallow the latest OS. And the other two smartphones Lite as well as Swipe Elite Plus is running on Android 5.1. Swipe Elite Plus has the fastest processor with Snapdragon 615. And the second fastest smartphone is uh, Redmi 3S with the Snapdragon 430 chipset. And the other two smartphones are pretty average in MediaTek processor. If you want to play some AV graphic games, go with Swipe Elite Plus or Redmi 3S. And you must also know that Swipe Elite Plus tends to heat a lot while playing games. Do know that. As said, Coolpad Mega looks much more premium than other three smartphones. The second place goes to Redmi 3S. Speaker output is really good in Redmi 3S and Coolpad Note 3 Lite. Let's talk about the camera. Except Coolpad Mega, all the three smartphones have 13 megapixel rear facing camera with single LED flash. Whereas Coolpad Mega just has 8 megapixel rear facing camera. Let's compare the sum of the sample images. You can check the quality for yourself. Same object has been captured with all the four smartphones. I personally felt the fourth one is really good, the Swipe Elite Plus because of its detail in the image. But when you see at this image, I pick 1 and 4 in this option. Redmi 3 has performed decently well. So as far as the rear camera is concerned, I pick Swipe Elite Plus as number 1 and Redmi 3 is slightly below that. Coolpad Note 3 Lite and the last place goes to Coolpad Mega 2.5D especially in the rear facing camera. But these results might change on the front facing camera. Both Redmi 3S and Coolpad Lite have 5 megapixel front facing camera. Coolpad Mega and Swipe Elite Plus has 8 megapixel front facing camera. So let's compare the sum of the sample images that I have taken with the smartphone. So these were the shots that I have taken in all the four smartphones. In outdoor condition, the colors and the skin tone looks really good in Swipe Elite Plus. The second place goes to Coolpad Mega 2.5D. And Redmi 3S has a slightly better image when you compare with Coolpad Note 3 Lite. So overall in camera section, Swipe Elite Plus was the one which you want to go for if you are a camera lover. Let's talk about the battery backup of the smartphone. Redmi 3S has 4100 mAh battery and believe me, it has a, one of the best smartphone you can buy at this price tag with the heavy battery backup. 
Both Coolpad Note 3 Lite as well as Vipel Plus has 3000 mAh battery and it can last up to one day of AV usage. But when you're talking about Coolpad Mega, it just has 2500 mAh battery, the least when you compare it with all the other three smartphones. As always, do select the smartphone based on your needs and not based on the hypes. So have a look at this spec sheet again where I have highlighted the best features of all the four smartphones. If you ask me, I pick Redmi 3S based on its 4G plus OLT capacity and full VR support as well as the heavy battery backup of 4100mAh battery with metal body finishing. I pick Coolpad Mega 2.5D, it has a 3.5GB RAM, 5.5 inch beautiful display, 8 megapixel front facing camera and it also has 4G plus OLT support. I will also pick Coolpad Note 3 Lite if I want a fingerprint scanner and 3GB RAM with dual SIM card support plus SD card support. I will pick Swipe Lite Plus if my needs are excellent front facing camera as well as rear facing camera and complete VR support with a good battery backup and it also has the one of the fastest processor but you also need to know that it will tend to hit while playing games and while watching VRs. So out of these four smartphones I pick Redmi 3S over other three smartphones. It also got an IR blaster on top so it has add an advantage. If you still have any doubts about these smartphones, do watch their unboxing, gaming review as well as in-depth camera review about these smartphones in our channel. I will leave the link for the same in the description box below. As always, I will leave the link in the description for the best buy for all these four smartphones. If you still have any doubts in shopping online on any gadgets or any smartphones or TV or laptop, do contact me in my Facebook page at Ausit. I will try to help you out in the max of my knowledge. I hope this video was helpful. If it does, do hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more awesome videos like this. This is Thames signing off. Hope to see in my next video.